let's say I'm asking you like to so have three points random and if I tell you to draw a curve passing through these three points so what we will be doing it first we will name like A B C we will join A to B bisect AB bisect BC wherever it will cut from that point I can draw R A B C right okay now I'm giving you one more example in that I have given you a rectangle and let's say there are three points so this is A, this is B and this is C and if I want a curve passing through A, B, C so what I'll be doing it first I'll join A to B B to C then I'll bisect So wherever they will intersect, that is point O, and from point O, I can draw an arc. Now let's say if they want to draw a continuous curve, like in this, point D is point E and they want you to draw a continuous curve passing through A, B, C, D, E. So what will you do? You will join C to B bisect C, D and this is point O. So we will write O1 and draw a line passing through O1, C and X10. Wherever it will cut that is point O2. I will take O2 to C and we draw this arc. Then let's say if I want to draw a curve passing through DE also. I am joining D to E, bisect DE. Now O2. Now what we will do, we will draw a line passing through O2, B and X10. So wherever we cut, that is O3 to B. Got it. The same way we can draw point F. Again, same procedure. You bisect EF. O3, E, X10. You will get O4. Again, you can draw arc. So this way we can draw a continuous arc. Now let's say we have a curve, let's say point A, point B, and point C. And if you want to find out the length of this arc, you have only an arc like ABC. And if you want to find out the length of this arc, then what will you do? First, you will join. E to C and extend the line. And then you bisect AC. You take O to A cut on this side. That is point M. This is point P. So from point P we have drawn R A B C. Then you have to bisect A C. Then you take this distance equals to this distance. That means we'll take this radius or uh, we'll take this there distance O A. We will cut on this side that is point M. Now we'll take M to C and we'll draw arc. Now after this I will join P to A and we will draw a perpendicular. 
you know how to draw perpendicular? First you draw arc, then from here we cut on this side, this side, then cut on both the sides. tangent. So, AQ is the length of an arc ABC. 